guys in this video we will be learning modules in python modules in python are the python files containing definitions and statements of the same it contains python functions classes or variables modules in python are saved with the extension .py let's see in the example first what we have to do we have to create one new file in our demo project new employee module demo okay we will create a new function inside this new module i'm going to create a function def get employee details print save or even we will take input as well right employee name i'm taking and i'm saying here employee name now we will go back to our main program that is module demo import this module which we created recently so to import module we have import keyword import employee module you could see all the modules are appeared here we will import employ employ module and we have defined one function inside this module we are going to call this function in another program dot you see as soon as you type in dot you could see the method available in this module okay so you just click enter here it is expecting one employee name its spelling is not correct let me check then pass on the parameter value okay execute the program click on this you see inside employee module raj we are able to get the methods of different modules and we are able to execute it now we see types of python modules there are two type of python modules what is built in modules like math sys these are the example of inbuilt modules in python let me import math okay here what we want we want to let's say calculate the factorial of any number so what we will do let's say where 1 equals to let's say 10 print the factorial of 10 is now we have to call the factorial function from math okay we will just say print math dot factorial you see factorial and it is even expecting one argument x okay let's run the program you see the factorial of 10 is this value let's say i'm taking 3 then check so you see the factorial of 3 is 6 second is user defined modules in python you, you have already seen these are the user defined the file which we created for modules now let's see variables in python modules we have already discussed that modules contain definition and classes but apart from function and classes modules in python can also contain variables in them variables like tuple list dictionary object etc can create n number of variables inside the modules and then you can use it outside other module we just go back to our employee module and we take some let's say employee list and we are defining name of our employees like so this is our variable in our custom module okay 
user defined module i'm going to use these variables employee module demo dot you see employee list i could see i'll be printed on the first position what employee i have it is ravi okay so it should be printed as ravi let's run it you see you can create n number of variables where one okay you can use this as well where one let's run it you see we can define whichever function variable or classes we need we can do it so we can use from keyword okay let's say from if i say i have employ module then right i only need specific members from the module let's say i have just created variables of employee list you see employee list then it will give you only the employee list from that employee module demo okay let's try to print it you can take and you can take zero that way it will work if i change it another employee name will be listed you see so this is the one example of getting a specific type of members from any module let's say if you want to get more members from the module you have one more method get employee details you see inside the module dinesh okay if you want to import all the members from the modules you can use a strict symbol from let's say employ then we can say import and then we can say asterisk this is the same meaning as we do it like import let's say employee or import math this is the same meaning okay that brings us to the end of the today's video we hope you found it informative and engaging don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content on all things tech related thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video